Jesus. If you're tuning in to the Minister of Wellness Ministries video, if I've helped you in your health and you're tuning in to the live streams uh, and you see that I consistently ask for your support, and this is where your money is going. This is one of three of the orphanages that we support, one of the children's homes uh, that we support every single month, and we need more funds uh, because I know that this home is trying to build a school. So we need more funds and more support. And if you're benefiting from me in any way, shape, form, or fashion, and you're uh, listening to this commercial and you see these beautiful children, if you don't have the heart to give, uh, then I'm asking you to unsubscribe and watch somebody else because I'm not a YouTuber. I am a real missionary. I'm a minister uh, doing groundwork for the Lord uh, here. And your dollar stretches a lot more here than it does in America. So do the right thing, brothers and sisters, and give to the ministry. You see all the ways that you can on the screen is absolutely no excuse. So thank God uh, Mike Tyson came to his senses and he postponed, which I believe is not going to happen, this charlatan fight uh, with this, this evil snake, Jake Paul, who was looking to use the name of Mike Tyson uh, to gain unprecedented fame and fortune. This boy keep talking about he want to be a world champion and he wants a real boxing career, but the only fighter he fought at his actual uh, size and age, he lost to. He got outboxed, you know, so the fight was supposed to happen in July. And that was Tommy Fury, the little brother of Tyson Fury, who got uh, defeated for the undisputed heavyweight championship May 18 by Alexander Usyk. Yes, I'm. Yes, it is still very, very difficult for me not to, to to completely stop following what has always been my one and favorite sport of all, and that's boxing. I never liked it this fight, and it seems like the medical emergency, the reason why, I don't know. I mean, my videos get viewed by a lot more people than what you might think. Uh, I believe I'm the only one that titled the video saying that Mike Tyson could die and that maybe he's looking to die. And so who knows, but is, I, I don't know family, you know, that all of a sudden um, after that video is dropped and now the fight is canceled, it's not happening. The Mike Tyson, Jake Paul fight is not happening because of the medical emergency. And I look at these boxing channels and oh, the ignorance about the human body is absolutely terrifying. Today is June the 2nd, 2024. So if you're listening to this live, you're blessed because it's the last day for free shipping weekend. We did free shipping for Friday, Saturday. So this is the last day, brothers and sisters, it ends tonight. I'll turn off the free shipping. It gives you 20%. Okay, that's everything on the online store. So go to the minister of wellness.com and get what you need free shipping for those listening to this live. Also, I'm available for coaching and coaching, coaching. If you book a one on one with me, you get 25 percent off the whole store. You get a promo code automatically. So those who did coaching, you're blessed. And make sure if you did coaching with me, make sure you combine that with free shipping and you can really get some great savings. This is June 2nd, 2024. I mean, one guy that I listen to quite often and I mean, he just he he was admitting he was like, I don't know what an ulcer is. I don't know what this is. I don't know how it came about. It's like, brother, it's just all you have to do is, is a little bit of research. An ulcer is is the the lining of the stomach, the colon or the esophagus, the esophagus, the colon, the stomach, the small intestines. And it become in and, and, and it develops sores. Yeah, sores from acidity. 
Then he was like, I don't even know where how that happens. It happens from lifestyle, primarily what you eat. And I told you all, Mike Tyson, he was saying that in order to get back the rage that he would need to fight Jake Paul at 58 years old. Now, remember, Tyson was getting knocked out 20 years ago. And you trying to come back 20 years later and fight some young, strong kid. So he was talking crazy, saying he was eating raw meat and eating tiger flesh and all of this satanic stuff. Yeah, that'll tear your stomach up. Yeah, that'll cause ulcers, acidity, anything without fiber putrefies in the body. And yes, it can cause holes. I've dealt with people who have extreme ulcerative colitis, irritable bowel syndrome. All of these are related. Acid reflux disease. They're all in the same category. I have videos on each of them. It can get so bad you can't even eat. Well, your stomach can't handle nothing but cook zucchini and potato. This is not something to be taken lightly. This ended the career of Brock Lesnar, the Neanderthal Viking monster who was destroying everybody when he went from WWE to UFC. He wasn't losing until health took him out. He was humbled by health. Which, of course, if you follow my Bible studies, which many of you all don't, unfortunately. But for those who follow my Bible studies, you know. That being struck down with diseases is one of the punishments against the wicked. But that's what took Brock Lesnar out was a digestive disorder. Because then he, you're not able to eat and get the nourishment you need. This fight is not happening. I'm glad they came to their senses in Canada. It's not happening. Now, Mike Tyson talking about rescheduling at the end of the year, but his ulcer was so bad it was bleeding. The sore was bleeding internally. And he was bleeding internally, and he had to get rushed to the emergency room off of the airplane. Bro, you all the drugs, the cocaine, the alcohol, all of the toxic junk food you have eaten, and, you know, Tyson, he's trying to get back in there and train like he in his 20s and 30s. Your body can't handle that no more. Your body is shot. We have everything in stock, brothers and sisters, except for the DHA EPA. It'll be back soon. But all orders are caught up. Our inventory is full. Listen, when you support the Minister of Wellness Ministries online store at the retail cost, it truly helps us out. Because we use the profits to fund critical ministry expenses, such as funding our missionary work, financially supporting our small team of workers, and paying the thousands of dollars of monthly bills related to running this healing ministry. Running sales are great on rare occasions, but overall, they hurt the financial health of the ministry. I know you all love them. But overall, it hurts the financial health of the ministry. So please consider this next time you're in need of supplementation. The Minister of Wellness labeled and approved organic iris sea moss, organic vitamin C, organic superfood powder, herbal extracts, and much more of the highest quality and potent, a brand you can always trust but also you can have the peace and joy of knowing that every dime of profit is being used to support this one of a kind revolutionary healing ministry. If you need help placing an order, please call 888-847-8026. That's 888-847-8026. Call or text that number 888-847-8026. Or you can visit our vast online store at the minister of wellness.com knowledge is power brothers and sisters don't forget about your knowledge uh, i am the author of five books your minister of wellness five books lose 100 pounds in 100 days that's a book based on a real life life testimonial help the brother lose 100 pounds in 100 days his exact meal plan and exercise plan is in that book 
along with the 12 components of food addiction at the end, biblical principles that eradicate obesity and all disease. It covers the top killers and how eating healthy change in what we eat can help eradicate those diseases according to the word of God, exposing the deadly slave theology of the black church concerning health and nutrition. Uh, Jesus will bless you, your junk food, saying grace uh, under the new covenant. We don't need to worry about the dietary laws. These critical theological issues revolving food, nutrition, and our walk with Christ is covered in that book. Exposing the satanic religion of the you know what. Such an important yet controversial book. I can't even show the cover on the screen. And then the latest book that I made right here for the motherland is the homosexual war that's being waged to remove Africa from God's divine protection. The Minister of Wellness dot com under books, the Minister of Wellness dot com under books or call 888-847-8026. Call or text 888-847-8026. 888-847-8026. Eight four seven eighty twenty six. The Minister of Wellness Complete Detox Package, brothers and sisters, I created this package specifically to help detox from the medical decision. You should realize I'm using, I'm being very careful in using cold language and all toxic overload that taxes our system, weakens our immune system. I put together, I, I had this before due to extreme censorship. I had to use wisdom and I had to bring it back in a different manner, but it is back by popular demand. You get the, the very powerful immune support, detox, gut health, mental health, reduce inflammation, the iris sea moss, the dull seaweed, and then you see that spot there, my book. Again, I have to be smart and use wisdom. This is the book that I have exposing the medical decision, and it has the full detox plan for the medical decision. And this is all of them, all of these poisons that we've taken since our childhood, the overload of toxic exposure that is taxing our system. This is my complete detox package the minister of wellness.com the minister of wellness.com or call 888-847-8026 888-847-8026 this fight will never happen and it shouldn't happen he was going to die in that ring you and then it's not like it just goes away because guess what these idiots do you remember we have god's healing system and then satan's Pseudo healing. Pseudo means it's a fake copycat. It's not health care, it's death care, it's sickness care. So when people are having ulcers, when when you have when when the acidity of your diet and lifestyle has torn your gut up so much that you have holes in your intestines, in your colon, your stomach, the first thing I do is I put people on melons. One of my success stories is on a video. You can see it for yourself. A brother said he had ulcerative colitis for years until he came across this ministry. All praises to the Most High. But that's the first thing. If you're having any type of digestive issues, the best type of solution to go on is a melon fast, especially watermelons. Because they're soft and very low in acidity level and high in water to hydrate and replenish uh, your colon, your esophagus, wherever the ulcers are. But there are some people where it's so extreme, they can't even handle melons. They have to do, you have to take the alkalinity, the alkalinity of the raw fruit is so strong, they can't even handle it at all. So you have to do, you have to deaden the food and usually cook zucchini and cook potato fast, where that's all you're eating every few hours cook zucchini, cook potato. And then usually that is what is used to get people. And then once the digestive system heals, then you can get on your melons and then months and months down the line, but it can get severe. 
and it's debilitating and it can be deadly. There's nothing to play with. So Mike Tyson training hard. Like I said, how are you going to even spar if you have internal bleeding from stomach ulcers at 58 years old? You have to spar. For those who don't know what sparring is, that's practicing boxing. That's fighting in the gym to practice for the real fight. One of the most popular things that boxers do when they're training is they'll throw a medicine ball against their stomach. He can't do that. He can't get hit in the stomach. He can't even do sit-ups. I mean, like I said, 25 years ago, Mike Tyson was doing sit-ups and hurt his back. I broke my back when he fought Clifford Ntien and knocked him out in 49 seconds. And he was 35. I broke my back. My back is broken. And then Jim Gray asked him, okay, well, which part of your body is it the, uh, the vertebrae, the lower spinal? <laughs> spinal. I broke my back. My back is broken. Spinal. You all know Mike Tyson is a nutcase. So this is, I watched all this man's fights. I remember his last fight. And he get knocked down on the he get knocked down on the canvas and Mike Tyson holding his arm up for the referee to lift him up. This is years ago. Now you, you come in and now you coming back at, at no. No. So the Minister of Wellness was listened to. I posted a video saying he gonna die. That he will die. If he goes through with this with internal bleeding from it's not gonna heal. Unless Mike Tyson comes across the knowledge about how to properly, it doesn't go away. Brock Lesnar still suffers from ulcers to this day. Or whatever particular gut issue, he, he still suffers. He was never the same. And he still suffers from it because he's still eating like a Neanderthal. It's not going to go away. So they talk about postponing it. And what I was saying was that these idiots... And under Satan's pseudo healing, they'll sit there and give you anti-inflammatory drugs. They'll say, okay, well, your, your, your stomach, your digestive system is inflamed, so we'll give you pills. But guess what causes ulcers? The anti-inflammatory drugs. So that's not going to help them. Their drugs for ulcers cause ulcers. Typical pharmacia. So unless Mike Tyson is willing to go on a watermelon fat and then he has internal bleeding. So now we're talking about cooked zucchini and potatoes. Bro, you ain't fighting. I'm proud to announce the Minister of Wellness Ministries uh, housing development initiative. We are taking uh, poor families here in the motherland uh, living in dilapidated mud houses and we're taking them and we are building for them stone homes. We have started on building the first new home for our first family. Uh, they are excited. The ground has been broken for as little as 2,000 US dollars. We can take an entire family out of a dilapidated mud house and we can build for them a brand new stone home. If this ministry it's blessing you if my voice, my gift, my labor is helping you improve your life. Use one of the many ways you see on the screen and in the description box to support the missionary work that we are doing to save real lives and families. If you can't bring yourself to do that, despite being blessed continuously by this ministry, get off my channel. No leeches allowed. And you don't need to. Not no 26 year old. Now, if you're going to fight somebody your age, like Holyfield, and you all just do something for celebrity. But this, but this, but this consciousness, this consciousness, white devil, this man trying to kill Mike Tyson. He 26 years old and he trying to kill a 58 year old man. And instead of him moving on and fighting somebody his age, he still want to fight Mike Tyson. Broken 
speechless, like gutted. We've been working so hard over here, everyone in this camp. And I just feel bad for everyone involved in this event. The whole undercard, this is opportunity has been ripped from all of us. But I do uh, value Mike's health first and foremost. Love that guy. No, you don't. If you valued his health, you wouldn't be fighting a 58 year old man that was shot years ago. Mike Tyson wasn't even good years ago anymore. He hasn't been a good, great fighter since the 90s. You don't value that man. Hell, fight somebody your own age. You loser. Fight somebody your own age. What a, I mean, what a sick thing to do. And the saddest thing is that Netflix was going to sponsor this. To use that man. Like I said, that, this is going to be a fatality in the ring. Didn't I say that? Thank God a few hours after I posted that video, we have the new. It's not going to happen. Thank God it's not going to happen. Mike Tyson is not as suicidal as what I thought. I have so much respect for him, and um, I want Mike to be healthy. And he says he still is going to knock me out, and I bought myself some time. So Mike is still talking shit over there. Uh, but, Mike, if you want to do this, like you said, behind closed doors, behind the scenes, you've said you want to do this in Q4. You just need a little bit of time. So I'm ready whenever you are. This is Nah, bro, fight somebody your age, man. You're 26 years old, 230 pounds. Fight somebody your age. You said you wanted a real boxing career. This is pathetic. You're going to hold up the whole year waiting on the old man because you want to exploit his name for fame and fortune. These, I mean, what happened to respecting your elders? It's too big of an opportunity. I think this fight's going to change the world. And I turn all my L's into W's. That's a motto I live by. And the universe makes no mistakes. So let's see what's in store. But sorry this didn't work out to everyone, the fans. Love you guys. It's not the universe. It's the most high who created the universe. They own that idolatry nonsense. Yeah, this this kid, this, this dude don't have no conscience at all. I mean, he want, he literally is salivating over the thought of knocking out a 58-year-old man. Stomach ulcers don't go away. All of these idiots on these boxing platforms, there's nothing they can give him. Trust, I've dealt with this issue. For those of you who have any digestive issues, I have videos on all the different digestive issues. I'm telling you, look at the success story of the brother. I'll put the link in. The, it, this ain't nothing to play with. You don't just recover from ulcers. You don't. Once you tear your stomach up like that, it stays with you. Until you make the lifestyle changes, most people are not able to do that. So they just live with it and manage it for the rest of their life. And Mike Tyson got sciatica too. This man's body is broken down. So thank God this, uh, this, and like I said, all of this stuff, man, these people use these clowns to keep us entertained and uh, sitting here, uh, you know, people wrapped up into something and then it don't even happen. So that's the update on that, brothers and sisters. And uh, prayerfully, it never happens because I, I don't, as, as much as Mike Tyson uh, has done and said things that have been a complete embarrassment on behalf of our people. That don't mean that I want to see a 60 year old man get killed in the ring by some white devil. That's just you know, by young, strong white devil. That's just trying to uh, profit off of his blood. And don't forget brothers and sisters that free shipping is tonight. If you're blessed to listen to this live, Sunday, June 2nd, 2024. Go to the online store, theministerofwellness.com and get what you need. Everything free priority shipping. That's 20% savings. That's significant savings. If you book the consultation, you can combine your 25% off with the free shipping and that's significant savings. But I will turn off the free shipping tonight. So take advantage and get what you need before it's too late. Shalom. The most important package that I have for this time is the immune support emergency stash. So this is when, not if, when the next deadly pandemic comes and, and when we're locked back down. You don't want somebody coughing in your household and they don't have anything for their immune system. This is the time to get it. It'll be impossible to have these in stock when the masses are panicking. It's already priced at 50% off. You don't need a promo code. Get your stash for your immune system. The Minister of Wellness.com. 
theministerofwellness.com. This is the second package that I have, the Black Health Disparities Package. If you have comorbidities, you're not going to stand a chance. This package covers obesity, blood pressure, immune, diabetes with the blood sugar, and all diseases fall under inflammation. You get all five. There's no promo code needed. It's already it's already priced at half off, 50% off. No promo code needed. The Minister of Wellness.com. The Minister of Wellness. Dot com. The big five brothers and sisters that are the most important, that is absolutely essential or you will be deficient. If you're deficient, you can't have an optimal immune system for the next pandemic. Vitamin D3 with K2, D3 with K2, B12, DHA, EPA and zinc. Those are the big five. And we have those five available, organic, high quality and potent. The Minister of Wellness dot com on the store. The Minister of Wellness dot com on the store. Or click the link in the description box and pin comment section. You cannot eat fruits if you're infested with parasites. Those demons called parasites will sabotage your goals to be healthy. So the Minister of Wellness Ministries, we are affiliated with Zuma Nutrition. I have taken their parasite detox package with great success, and I know it will help you relieve vicious cravings so you can eat the medicine foods of God without it feeling like it's torture. The Minister of Wellness dot com on the store to purchase the parasite detox package or click the link in the description box and pin comment section so the ministry can get the credit for your purchase. Uh, we waste money on junk food. We waste money on things that we don't need. So how dare you waste money uh, given to the devil, given to our enemies, and then you don't have the heart uh, to give to this healing ministry so we can help continue to feed and support these children so they can grow up and be successful in life. And raise your hand if you want to be a doctor. Who wants to be a doctor? Raise your hand. All right. Wow. Look at all those hands going up. So in order to do that, we have to eat to live. And that's why the Minister of Wellness Ministries, and this is just the start, the start with your support. And then we can support children's homes all over uh, the motherland. OK. <laughs> yes.